Welcome to the Project Finance Modeling Course. In this tutorial, we will be looking at Revolving Credit Facility or Revolver in Project Finance. We've already seen that the project's capex is funded by the debt in the form of the construction debt refinanced into term loan during the project's operation and equity coming from the project's sponsor. However, during the project's operation, the project may need a line of credit from the lenders which is called a revolving credit facility. Revolver in project finance is usually a standby facility subordinated to the term loan, debt service reserve account, and maintenance reserve account. This is in contrast to corporate finance, where a revolving credit facility is usually a senior debt. In the end, loan agreements will specify the seniority of the revolver with respect to the term loan, debt service reserve account, and maintenance reserve account which shall be reflected in the project finance model. Revolver typically has an established maximum amount where the project has access to the funds at any time when needed. This type of loan is mostly used for operating purposes to cover the unexpected shortfalls in the cash flows. Revolver is designed to be called upon in the event of emergency capital investment or significant fluctuations in working capital. Revolver as a standby facility may also be required if the project company issues bonds to the public market and requires a rating from the credit rating agencies. Such a standby facility will contribute to making the project company bankruptcy remote. The revolver is often structured with a cash sweep provision. This means that any excess cash flow after servicing the term loan, debt service reserve account, and maintenance reserve account will be used by the bank to pay down the outstanding balance of the revolver. Furthermore, if in any period there is insufficient cash to pay the revolver's interest expense, that interest expense is rolled over or, in other words, the interest expenses is added to the revolver's outstanding balance. In the next lesson, we will learn how to model the revolving credit facility in Project Finance Model.